Hey, my name is Jessica Owen, and I am psychinetic psych controlled musician. When you are diagnosed with severe cerebral palsy, the term independent doesn't quite fit into your day to day life. Unless you really think outside the box. I am extremely lucky, both Psychonetic and Steve Bilby have the same mindset as me, which is anything is possible, you just have to come up with a solution, and then do it. Five years ago, I saw Steve performing on stage, and that was it. From that night onwards, I wanted to perform with him. But how? I have a severe physical disability? The solution was Psychonetic Atmosphere which is a software package that allows me to perform music in front of a live audience via eye control. Steve Balby, here I come. It was a success, we performed at several corporate events with the help of our psychonetic software engineer, Nick Temple, assisting me with the tech setup. I am extremely close to Nick, he is like a brother to me, when I have him beside me, I know everything is going to work and I feel safe. But both Nick and Steve knew that it was time to make me independent, fully independent, on stage, in front of an audience, of people we knew. And I said, yes. Even though Nick had bruises on his arm, from me not wanting to let him go, I knew that I had to take this step to prove to people in my situation it is possible. Plus it was something that I really wanted to achieve for myself be a regular member of a band, no special treatment. Let's do this. Becoming independent on stage wasn't exactly easy, not only did I have to learn a new song, I had to work out how to physically turn on my computer, calibrate my eye control, open and close two versions of atmosphere, and shut down before the power was cut to my computer. All with my own hands while I had a couple of hundred people staring at me. With Steve looking at me, I replied sure thing, I can do that, piece of cake, no problems. But on the inside I felt like curling up into the fetal position, I was scared. Solution time. Okay I can physically use a mouse pad, and shortcut keys reasonably fast, faster if I practice it over and over again. Ok I need a Bluetooth keyboard with a keyguard, strap the keyboard to my lap, bonus that will also keep my leg still. Now I can program keyboard shortcuts for everything, and we are done. Yes, and it was a success I was fully independent on stage. We had a great gig, every performance with Steve is the best, but this one was special, because we made the impossible possible. Now Psychonetic and I are going to add more functionality to Atmosphere, to allow everyone to operate those shortcuts via eye control, without having to use a keyboard. However I just wanted to illustrate, sometimes you need to be open-minded enough to tackle the impossible and come up with the weirdest solutions, before it can come your reality. Hard work pays off.